Okay, and welcome back, and here we go. We're going through this next door, and we are going to be seeing this nice little round thing in front of us. It's very nice and looks really awesome. And as we go towards it, we got a cutscene. You can see its eyes nice and glowy. Okay, now this one is a really fun boss battle. Yes, as I said, it's a boss battle. Right, first off, we have these things we have to destroy. It's a good idea to face them in the time. And then we can touch this landlord thing and go to the next stop. This So, we should do also. faces uh, were hit four two times. I don't know what I was about to say four times. Oh, some of these are locked. That's one locked. Let's change to Liana because she's an expert to uh, lucky mastery. Just like you want. It's got a nice light on there. A light on there. Change back to me and we go on and we're finished with the trials. Yep, this is the chamber of the altar. The that thing, anvil. That's it. anvil of the void. This is the antechamber. And we're about to see someone very nice. Was? If you <coughs> seek the anvil, then you must care about my story, or be doomed to be <sighs> So you want something? Everyone does. I do. I live to ensure that the anvil was never used again. Now it never shall be. It allowed me to forge a man of steel or stone as flexible and clever as any soldier. As an army, they were invincible, but I told no one the cost. No mere smith, however skilled, has the power to create life. To make my golems live, I have. 
Ooh, ten feet tall and invulnerable. I can think of worse fates. It was an option I could offer warriors who would volunteer to defend their homeland, and some took it. But King Valtor became greedy. He began to force men, castless and criminals, his political enemies, all of them were to be given to the anvil. It took feeling the hammer's blow myself to realize the height of my crime. Okay, so that you earned it. I am trapped forever in my own creation. A fitting punishment, I suppose. My apprentices knew enough to make me as I am, but not enough to fashion a control rod. I retained my mind. Control what? We have remained entombed here ever since, and I have sought a way to destroy the animal. Alas. I cannot do it myself. No golem can touch it. No! The anvil is mine! Here she comes. No one will take it from me! You! Please! Help me destroy the anvil! Do not let it enslave more souls than it already has! Ah! This is where a choice uh, um, presents, us, uh, presents itself. This is a hidden two-way street. Now, you need either one of these. You don't need both. So there's no middle choice at this, this point. If you want to have Caradin as your um, backer, the anvil must be destroyed. If you want Bronca as your backer, and will always be uh, preserved. Uh, some characters will reflect negatively uh, depending on your choice. The team I've got right now is chosen because I want to make this choice. Don't listen! He's been trapped here for a thousand years stewing in his own madness. Help me claim the anvil, and you will have an army like you've never seen! Bronca, you mad, bleeding nuttail! Does this thing mean so much to you that you can't even see what you've lost to get it? Look around. Is this what our empire should look like? A crumbling tunnel filled with dark spawn spume? The anvil will let us take back our glory! You are really, really, really twisted, lady. Thank you, stranger. Your compassion shames me. No! You will not take it! Not while I still live! Ronka, don't Deal. throw your life away for this! Uh, we have to destroy the anvil. Just give her the blasted thing. She's confused. Maybe once she calms down, we can talk to her. She was born confused. You're not the only Master Smith here, Keradin. Golems, obey me! Attack! No, she's got you Harry Potter so wand. My friend, you must help me. I cannot stop her alone. Man, this is going to be fun. Keradin, you must help me. This is going to be fun. Okay, uh, let's, let's give ourselves a good arena. Okay, not sure whether it is well. Okay, you want to play rough? I'll give you rough. Face storm of the central. There, I should give us a bit more. Well, Storm's still going. Well, well, well. Okay, you get Vanguard, Bronca's Shield, and Expert Wama's Rune. 
uh, from Broncos uh, Corpse as well as with that little bit in there. Right. I'm not sure whether it was seen. I'll just do this part here. Right, go and register. He's having a tent more close to me. He's really dwarven. So, since we can't read it, uh, can you tell us what it is, Mugwin? Names. Long list of dwarves. Hold on. We honor who have made this sacrifice. Let their names be remembered. Fart me a lullaby. It's a memorial of all the dwarves who became golems. Has to be. If there was some way of getting this back to the Shaper at Norzimar, I bet they'd frown their trousers and pay good gold for it. Probably both. There is. I'm going to trace it. I know I've done that. Let's go up here and grab some items. Oh, uh, by the way, uh, the battle against Branca, you might spend a lot of time uh, going from Lyrian Vane to Lyrian Vane to prevent her from using them. Well, the door will be good. Another life lost because of my invention. I wish no mention of it had made it to history. Yeah, you ain't kidding, stupid woman. Always knew the Amber would kill her. But at least it ends here. I thank you for standing with me, stranger. The Amber waits there for you to shatter it. Is there any boon I can grant you for your aid? A final favor before I am freed from my burden? Well, before we continue this, I shall uh, end the video here and start next time. I shall see you then.